Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. This look is like a space alien princess type of thing going on and it is a collaboration with Chua. She is an amazing makeup artist. She does body paint and it's just really amazing and she loves using glitter in a lot of her looks and I really recommend you go check out her Instagram to check those out because she is really talented and I'm excited to be collaborating with her on this look that I created. This is a little out of my zone. I'm more just like glam but this is just kind of like a glam space princess type of thing. I did my best. I'm not used to using eyeshadow on another part of my face other than my eyes and this is the first time me using a cosmetic glitter for a look. I really had fun doing this look. So if you want to jump into the tutorial to see how I created it. I didn't really talk much throughout doing it just because it's new to me. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just winging it. But I think it turned out really well and I hope you guys check it out. So let's go ahead and get into the video. do is start with some transition shades. So I am going to be going in with my Too Faced Natural Palette. I'm going to take the shade Heaven right here and just set my eyes real quick. And then I'm going to take the shade Nudie and use that for my transition. It's really weird like having like purple eyebrows. It's like, I don't know, I had to use like eyeshadow instead of pomade so it was kind of weird and a little bit difficult. But I tried to make it work as well as I can. It was kind of hard to just kind of like overdraw. So I just did the best that I could with the eyebrows for this look. So bear with me. And I am using the E27 brush from Morphe. This is just a nice fluffy blending brush and it's one of my favorite brushes. I'm not even sure that we actually need a transition shade for this look. I'm just kind of winging it. Alright, so for this look, it's going to be mostly pink tones and some purple to contrast the look. So I think I'm going to go in with these two pink shades right here from the 35B palette from Morphe. And I'm just going to take it like I would contouring basically. And I'm going to be using the BH Cosmetics Blush Brush. To do that. So I'm just gonna lightly dip in that and then I'm gonna take some of this shimmer pink right here just so that we have a nice shimmery look going on. And I'm just gonna tap that off the excess because I don't want it to be too extreme but I want to be able to build it up slowly. I'm gonna do the eyes last just because I'm not sure exactly how I want to go about that just yet. Just kind of trying to give my face like a little like light hue of pink. Since we are going for that alienistic princess type of look. Now I'm just going to add a very like smidge of purple just to kind of deepen the contour a little bit. And I'm going to take the contour brush from BH Cosmetics. And I'm just going to dip into this pink with purple undertone and then this purple up here. Those are both shimmery, so I'm just going to go light-handed with these. And I'm going to blend it out with the same blush brush that I was using. I'm going to go back in with those pink shades just to kind of get it back to some pink or get some pink back to my flesh, uh, so to speak. Now we're going to add a little bit of highlight for that. I'm going to be using my Nicole Grow and Anastasia Collaboration Highlighting Palette. This palette is seriously so gorgeous. I'm happy that this palette is vegan as well. I'm going to go ahead and mix Kitty Cat with Forever Lit. And to do that, I'm going to be taking my BH Cosmetics Highlighting Brush. I'm just going to spray my brush in there. Tap off some excess. 
And look at that highlight though. I'm trying not to be too loud because it's like very echoey in this room. So for my nose contour, I am going to be using another BH brush. These don't really have like a legit name. They just have like numbered like 1 through 9. This is brush 8, which is kind of this flat contour brush. I'm going to use this shimmery pink and mix it in with this shimmery pink that has that purple undertone and start off with that. And then maybe I'll add some more purple to it. I'm just going to drag the pink down the nose somewhat just to add some more definition to the nose. I'm going to use this purple shimmery purple again and then I'm going to mix it in with that pink purple undertone just to kind of tone it down a little bit so it's not too purple. And this one we're just going to focus more uh, on the contour area instead of dragging it out. Then I'm going to go back in with my highlighter and I'm going to use the Forever Lit, which is that white highlight. And I'm going to use that to go down the bridge of my nose and put some intensity to it. To do my eyes, I'm going to be using the pink shades first just to kind of lay down and then I'm going to use some purples to deepen it up. So I'm going to be taking my MAC 217 brush. I had spoken about um, the Kylie brush and the Royal Peach palette being similar to this one and I went ahead and got it just to test the waters and see how well it works. So this is the first time I'm going to be using it and then I'm just going to go in with this matte ink right here first and just kind of lay that into my crease. Alright, so my camera did die in the middle of that, but I was putting on the muted pink right here. I was putting that on top of my eyelids. While my camera was dead, I did kind of deepen up my contour a little bit. I just thought it was a little too light, so I added some more purple to it. Now I'm just going to go in with my 217 brush from MAC, and I'm going to go ahead and lay down that, the purple in my crease. And I'm just going to go ahead and go with this muted purple right here real quick. And just kind of go in there and I'm just kind of drag it all the way to the bridge of my nose so you'll see it kind of connect a little bit and then I'm gonna connect that right there just kind of deepen up my outer corner a little bit okay so we're just gonna do the same thing to the other eye we're just gonna focus that in the crease first Then I'm just going to drag some purple underneath my lash line, just kind of focus it on the outer corner. Then I'm just going to take the Morphe Fluffy Brush just to kind of blend out the edges. And then I'm just going to go in with this darker purple right here just to kind of deepen up and mix it with this blue-ish purple here and just lightly tap it off. I don't want it to be too overwhelming, I just want it to give it a little dimension. And then I'm going to go back and with this muted purple to kind of blend everything together. And then I'm just going to take this muted pink again and just focus that on my inner lid. So now that we have our eyes done, so I'm going to take this cosmetic glitter from Charisma Beauty. It's just this nice chunky glitter and it's kind of like a pink prismic type of thing and it has like different shapes. It has like some stars and some hexagons and type of things like that in there. So it's just going to work to make this look a little more galactic alien princess type vibes, I guess. Ooh, it's going everywhere. I'm going to take my eyelash glue and this is from the brand Absolute New York. I really love this eyelash loop just because it keeps my lashes on all day and you know they're good when you kind of like, eh, that's kind of like, never mind, but you get the gist of that. So it comes out like this and it dries clear. So I'm just going to dab it where I want the cosmetic glitter to be. So I'm going to apply some underneath my eyes. And put some in the tear duct area and just make sure that this now I've never done this before this is like the first time for everything using cosmetic glitter this type of style and everything so everything is new to me. but I'm just gonna go ahead and take my finger and just kind of dab it on there So 
then we're going to do the same with the other side. I'm not going to do any like eyeliner or anything with this look because I want it to be, I don't want there to be too much black in it. You know, to be honest, I don't even think this look needs lashes or anything. I'm just going to add some lipstick. We're going to go from there. So I went ahead and I applied the Chrysanthemum from Jeffree Star. I really love this lipstick. It's one of my favorites. It is this like a gorgeous like muted pink with champagne shimmer in it. And it's just gorgeous. So I went ahead and put that on. And then... And then I'm just going to spray my face with some Fix Plus. They actually have some scents now for these travel ones. I don't know about the larger size, but there's like lavender and coconut. But I went ahead and I got the lavender just because it smells amazing. Okay, I just want to make sure that I have it really set down because there's like a lot of glitter. I um, really like how this turned out. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really had fun and I just want to thank Chula again for pushing me out of my persona. This is a little different. I'm not used to having purple eyebrows, no lashes, and purple contour and everything, and glitter all over my face. That's definitely a first. And I really had fun and it's very different for me, but I really enjoyed it and I might do it again sometime. If you liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to comment and subscribe down below. I post new videos every Sunday, but you guys have an amazing day and have and peace out. First question is, and do you have any pets? Yes, I have my little Yorkie. His name is Chewy. He's such a sweetheart, but he's also such a big baby.